Good morning guys, Leanne here on Grady's Mom. I'm starting a new week of what I packed my husband and myself for work lunches for the week. So starting off, of course, Monday, I'm giving Matt this Gatorade Fierce Blue Cherry Drink and Arnold Palmer Half and Half Iced Tea Lemonade. And of course, as always, the water cooler. I made some pasta salad yesterday as part of my food prep for the week. So we've each got pasta salad, a nice good portion. These containers I get questions on all the time, guys. They're from Grove Collaborative. You could just go to grovecollaborative.com and search under like um, kitchen and pantry food prep type of things and you will find them. The lids are here. They're very airtight. I really like these containers a lot. I'm also giving Matt some grapes, green grapes we have been loving lately. One of these Reese's Puffs little cereal granola bar type of things here obviously a fork so he can eat, and then some Lay's barbecue chips. I am having pasta salad as well, obviously my fork. I've got my clear American strawberry drink. I've got my Yeti cup with ice and water. I'm also gonna bring this mixed berry yogurt, and I'm gonna take some of this honey bunches of oats granola. This is the toffee almond flavor put it in a little Tupperware so I can eat it with the yogurt. And I also have a little bit of almonds left at work, so I'm gonna finish those up. And I think I also have a granola bar at work as well. So yeah, guys, this is our lunch on Monday, and I'll see you tomorrow. Morning, guys, it's Tuesday, and I'm getting ready to pack us up. I am actually off work today. I'm going on a field trip with Grady's class. So I was told to pack a light lunch because you have to carry it with you all day. Um, hopefully that makes sense. So what I plan to do is normally I don't eat breakfast in the morning at home Because I'm not hungry today. I'm going to have to force myself to eat Like a yogurt granola fruit or something else because I have to have something in my stomach Because again, we have to pack a light lunch. So I'm bringing a water I've got a small thing of pasta salad a sandwich here on these. Let me show you guys the rolls. They're the um, coffee cup bakery from Vermont Burlington Vermont Kaiser rolls are really good. So I've got turkey lettuce tomato bacon and a spicy mustard um, For my lunch Matt has Turkey Swiss lettuce tomato bacon and mayo on the same roll. He's taking a blue cherry Gatorade uh, ginger ale a small thing of pasta salad black olives, and a granola bar because he's obviously just having a normal day. I have to pack these three things in a very, very small little cooler with an ice pack. I'll show you guys in a second here, but yeah, this is what we're having for lunches today. All right, guys, so here's a little cooler I have to bring today. It's like half, half the size of my normal cooler, maybe even less, but I have an ice pack back here. I've got my sandwich on top sideways. And then underneath, I've got my pasta salad. I cannot even fit this water in here, so I'm going to have to figure it out. But anyways, those are the lunches for today. We'll see you tomorrow on Wednesday. Good morning guys, it's Wednesday. I'm packing up Matt's work lunch. I have a Arnold Palmer half and half iced tea lemonade, a Propel grape water, the wrap you guys saw me make, a sun-dried tomato basil wrap with grilled leftover chicken from last night. It does have a marinade on it, which I think makes it even better. Some mayo, some crisp romaine, some Swiss cheese, and then a pickle on the side. I have some, the I had the last of the pasta salad to use up. So it was a perfect amount for an individual portion. So I gave Matt the last of our pasta salad and a fruit cup with strawberries and some blackberries in it. 
I'm also giving him a Sargento Sharp Cheddar Cheese stick. I actually have a couple hours off this morning. I have to do a couple hours of home staging, then I have a couple hours off, and then I have to go to my main job till 5.30. So I am actually going to be eating lunch at home today. So I'll be making some kind of hot lunch, and I will show you guys that later on in the day. Hey guys, so on Wednesday for lunch, I think I mentioned earlier when I showed you Matt's lunch, I had a couple hours this morning to play with, so I actually got my nails done, which desperately needed it, and made some hot lunch at home. I actually made a home chef dish. This is the tomato cream shrimp campanelli. This video is not sponsored. I genuinely love home chef, and when I order once a month, I usually use one or two of the four recipes that I get for lunches. So I just made this. It looks super good. I actually love broccolini and shrimp, so I'm going to devour this. I have plenty left over that I'm just going to let cool while I'm eating, and then I'll put it in a Tupperware in the fridge for another option for lunch or leftover, something like that. So I'm going to dig into this. It's about 11.15 in the morning. I'm going to eat this. I have a water here. I'm going to have some of these blackberries, and then I actually have to head to work till 5.30. So this is my lunch today on Wednesday, and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning on Thursday. Hey guys, for lunch on Thursday, I gave Matt a blue Gatorade here in the blue cherry flavor, and then a iced tea half and half lemonade, some leftovers. These were actually some Home Chef leftovers. They were like steak tacos with cheese and tomato, and I gave him a couple little packets of sour cream, a little granola bar, and some Pringles. Hey guys, it's Thursday. I did not have any time this morning to make my lunch. I actually had to leave a little bit earlier than normal to go to meet with Grady's teacher. But anyways, after my first job, I stopped at a local place here in the Lake George area called Kelly's Roots. It's really good local food. And I got my BLT fried egg sandwich on locally made bread. It was really good. The only thing is I forgot to ask for no mayo. I'm not a big mayo person, but it's my own fault. So I'm just going to go ahead and scrape a little bit of the mayo off. It also came with a side of Greek pasta salad and a pickle. And yeah, this is my favorite sandwich from there. I'm going to dig in and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning on Friday to show you what I'm packing for my husband. Good morning, guys. It's Friday. We made it to the end of the work week. Today I'm packing up for Matt, a Propel Vitamin Boost Electrolyte Water in the Peach Mango Flavor. This is sweetened with organic cane sugar, in case anybody's curious about what the sweetener is in here. A ginger ale, a salad that I actually just made. I have like all the stuff right here piled up. So it is a bed of romaine. I've got a ton of different veggies. I've got tomato, I've got broccoli, peppers, cucumbers, carrot, red cabbage and I think that's all for the veggies and then I did some sliced up I just sliced up some turkey meat and I put some sharp cheddar cheese on I've got his dressing cup and I'm going to give him this Marzetti simply dressed balsamic vinaigrette which I got I think at price right and this is like in the refrigerated section so not it won't be like in your regular dressing aisle it'll be in a refrigerated section um, at least this brand anyways. And then I did a fruit cup here. So I've got some green grapes, some blueberries, and some blackberries in here. I've got a peanut butter and chocolate chip bar, a fork, and that's his lunch today. I think what I'll do now is um, I've showed our lunch coolers and water cooler and stuff in many previous lunch videos, but I still get questions. So for those of you who already have seen those, thank you so much for watching. And if anybody is new and curious what lunch cooler and water coolers we use, I will share that now at the end. All right, guys, so I'm doing this part for those who have never seen or maybe you're new, but I have shared these before in other random lunch videos but I still continue to get a lot of questions about our lunch sort of equipment so this is my husband's cooler it's an igloo brand it's a very like standard size we got it at Walmart about five years ago and it's really easy to use obviously it's washable um, with today being Friday I'll wash it today after work because by the end of the week it gets a little grimy this is the water cooler that we use also from Walmart about five years ago. This is the Bubba brand and it's perfect uh, size. 
I just fill it up to about here with ice and then about this much to, with water and it melts down throughout the day. He can easily refill it. It's easy to clean. So both of those you can grab at like Walmart in like the sporting or uh, camping section, probably a place like Dick's Sporting Goods, that kind of thing. But yeah, this time of year in the summer, they're very easy to find. I use this cooler here. It's also about five years old. It's just a Vera Bradley cooler. Then the style of the cooler is called the Stay Cooler. I believe I did a whole video on this years and years ago. I will link that down below if I can find it. Um, this thing is, I mean, it's easily wipeable. It's squishy, so it's not like hard shell, but it is structured. So I just kind of wipe the whole thing down every time, you know, it needs it, um, sort of as needed, and wipe the inside down too. This thing has been used and abused, and it's still standing, and it just works perfectly for me to put like an ice pack drinks. Uh, and my lunch is in because sometimes, most of the time it's sitting in my car because I do the home staging job in the morning and then um, when I get to my second job I'll take everything out and put it in the work fridge. But yeah, I really love this. I'll link the video on it down below. And that is everything we use to carry our lunches.